Hi, my name is Jamie Curtis, and I work as a material process scientist engineer at Corning. I work in corporate product and process development in the Emerging Innovations Group New Programs Department. In that role, I work on development for new technologies that Corning is looking at. And currently I'm working on the micro LED project. I presented virtually at the SID conference this year, and I shared our prototype for the wraparound electrode concept and our fabrication process for our concept. We have actually used this concept to power TFTs, and it was really exciting. We saw minimal impact to TFT performance, which indicates that this technology could be used in the future. Micro LED enables you to make just a bunch of small pieces of glass and tile them together into a really big display. Think large TVs or potentially in football stadiums and other sports arenas. Everybody wants higher resolution displays and micro LED can help enable that technology. We're also looking for higher contrast ratios and brighter screens and micro LED can help with those as well. The reason that glass is advantageous for micro LED is because our glass can be produced extremely flat, achieving the specs that they need, and because it can withstand the high temperatures used in the TFT process. Glass is a really important player in this industry because it has the ability to withstand high temperatures for processing of TFTs. And one thing that this pandemic has certainly taught us is that there is an increased need for displays in our home lives. And this should be a driver for all sorts of new display technologies, including micro LED. So hopefully this technology will be rolling out soon in automotive interiors, in televisions, and in public spaces.